everyone. Welcome back to G'day Namaste. Today we are off to Enritza. So, um, Sunil is with me and his sister as well. So we are going to Amritsar and in typical Indian style, things did not go as smoothly as they should have and could have gone. <laughs> drive but this time we thought why don't we get a bus and experience like taking a bus on a on a long trip so yesterday I booked the bus tickets everything was fine and then this morning I got a message to say that uh, the bus had the our bus tickets had been cancelled so I tried calling the number and I got a an automated message that said um, thank you for calling the company um, please message on WhatsApp and you'll have a reply within seconds. Indian standard time, that did not happen within seconds. Maybe after like 40 minutes, someone replied back um, to say that the uh, tickets had been canceled because there was a mechanical issue with the bus. So that's all right. We then decided, why don't we try going by train instead? Uh, but there was no trains that sort of fit our schedule that we wanted. So now we are going to Amritsa by cab. We booked through um, this really convenient app called Make My Trip. And we'll come back tomorrow evening and we're going to come back by train. So lots to see and do and lots to experience. But I'm excited. I haven't been to Amritsa in a couple of years. Um, and it'll be nice to see the Golden Temple at night too. So it's really beautiful in the day, but it's very hot these days. So nighttime will be looking really beautiful and really excited. Any good road trip features snacks. So this is our snack bag. We have Doritos, sweet chili flavor. Some American style cream and onion chips. <laughs> My favorite, classic salted. I like a bit of an original can't forget the cookies. So Bon Vida is kind of like the Indian version of Milo for my people in Australia. Um, and they also make biscuits, which are really, really yummy. And I think, oh wait, no, I don't know what these are. Some chocolate chip biscuits. Sounds nice. And we'll probably stop on the way so I can get some candy. squeeze for Sunil up front but he's just happy to not to be driving so all is well. Okay so we have just reached Amritsa, checked into our hotel. I think it's around 10 30 so we're just freshening up and we're going to go visit Hamanda Saab uh, which is the golden temple um, and there's actually also a golden Hindu temple that I really really want to visit too so depending on the time tonight we might go today or even tomorrow. So the trip was good. I think I slept a lot of the way. <laughs> um, but yeah, drive was fine. We stopped midway for something to eat. Um, the hotel's really nice. It's just like a kind of simple hotel that is um, just outside of the busy part of Amritsa, but cabs run like all, all night, I think. Well, they're running now. So just being quite like a tourist location. That's the phone. We are here, we are ready. Um, we're going to call a cab and we're going to head to Golden Temple. So this suit I'm wearing, I actually got gifted from some friends. Uh, back when I visited India in 2018, I went to Patiala to visit two friends of mine and they gifted me this really, really beautiful suit. So I'm excited to wear it because it's very, very light and perfect for this kind of heat because it's so hot here. <laughs> so yeah, I'll, uh, take some photos, take some videos, and looking forward to visiting Amritsa again. So this is the main market area uh, before you walk into the area of Hamanda Sab or Golden Temple. So they have some hotels, street vendors, markets, bazaars. Not a lot of things are open because it is late at night, but um, it's still very busy, a lot of people and some things are open. YouTuber. I'm gonna turn the sound off it. Huh? I said I'm gonna mute it anyway. Why? Just like that. 
We are now approaching the Golden Temple. So this is one of the main gates. There are four main entries into Golden Temple. So we'll go through one of them. The view from this entrance shocks me every single time, day or night. It is so beautiful. Look at that. So Hadamanda Saab is surrounded by water known as Sadavad and there is a pathway walking all around the water that you can walk around. So that's what this view is of. So this is the other direction. It's pretty late at night, but it's still very busy, but very peaceful, just a completely different atmosphere compared to day. These vendors are very, very popular outside the Golden Temple area, so they're called Kufiwalas. They sell traditional uh, Indian ice cream called Kulfi, which is like a pistachio ice cream. Very delicious. Fun fact, uh, the areas around the Golden Temple are actually vegetarian, so this McDonald's is vegetarian only. It's 38 degrees today and we're in an auto, just zipping around. Uh, it's a lot of fun. It's been a while since I've been in one of these and I'm just enjoying watching everyone move around and it's completely different to being in a car. Um, I don't know, it's hard to explain, but super fun. We um, are at a restaurant called Bucket Restaurant. We are heading back to Chandigarh tonight. We're getting a train at around 5.20, I think. So we're, we're all pretty excited for a train trip. But yeah, we're just having some food now. Might try and go to the Durgyana, Durgyana Mandir, which is like the golden Hindu temple that's here. So we'll try and go there. It's near the station. And then we'll head our journey back home. Thanks. Right. This is the um, Amritsar train station. It's been a long time since I've been at a train station in India and yeah, it just looks like a lot of the others I've been in at the south. Um, this is the waiting room area. So no air con but fans, it's very cool and charging points. So that's where we're just waiting at the moment. Um, and here is one of the trains, not ours, obviously. <laughs> We are just leaving Amritsar, so this is, um, I guess, some of the back areas of Amritsar that we can see right now. It's pretty green, but also a bit brown because it's summer, but it's really nice going through the different villages and having a look around, again, different to being on the road. Punjab is known as the agricultural state of India, so most of what we've seen passing through the villages is actually farmland. So yeah, it's really nice to have a look at that and just see how the farms are doing. <laughs> okay, everyone, we are back. I look a mess. Um, yeah, just got home and it was a really, really, really cool trip, actually. Um, like I said at the start of the dogs as i said at the start of the video that usually sunil drives and this time it was just a completely different experience for us going there by cab um not having the stress of like him driving trying to find car parking like around golden temple and everything else and then um on the train on the way back was really fun we played uno i watched netflix uh, it went very very quick and yeah it was just a really 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 cool experience we didn't get to go to the other temple the Durgiana Mandir um, because by the time we got to the train station it was just very hot like I think it was about 40 degrees so we just decided against um, against going we just stayed in like the cool waiting room of the station um, but you know there's always next time we can go and have a look at that so that's okay <laughs> so if you've um, made it this far thank you so much for watching I hope you were able to enjoy um, 
the trip to Amritsa, Amritsa as much as we were able to enjoy it. Um, if you have made it this far, leave me an emoji in the comments, the one I've got on the screen here. Um, and yeah, I will see you same time, same place next week. Thank you so much. Bye.